Let's go. Good morning. Welcome to a wet and windy Manchester as usual. Nikon Z6 2470 f4 kit lens, Ronin SC gimbal, phone, phone holder, penny, base plate. Right, I'll show you how to balance this. A lot of people are struggling online, so I'll give you a quick uh, lowdown on how to do it. Hopefully, first time. Key thing to remember zoom lens. Every time you move the zoom on here, you're going to change the weight balance, so it's going to tip uh, and become unbalanced, and your gimbal might fail. So, pick a focal length that you want to use for the day. So I'm going to go with 24, just to keep things straightforward. Fasten the base plate on with the penny. Slide it on and down at the heavy end. Nice and firm, not too tight. And then keep an eye on this uh, guide for my balancing. Right, so, battery, tripod legs, two holes. One, Put this one in the smaller one. And keep the... The U pointing away from yourself. Pick up your gimbal, slide that towards you, clicks in, slide this lever. Okay, three axis all locked. So one, two, three, unlocked. And then it's ready to go. So I always have this round to the side and I'll lock the bottom one to start with. Pick your camera up and then guide it in. Keep hold of it at all times at this point. There we go. It has got a safety feature where it won't fall out, but it could still drop and bang. So I always keep one hand on it so that we're not tempting fate. Right, so slide along the guide. I'm looking at about 1.7 is where it's showing I'm balancing. So I'll tighten that one up. I'm just going to do all three axes. Yeah. Okay, so once you've done the first one, lock that one in, and then this one, it should basically find its way home. Now that looks ever so slightly heavy. So undo this top silver plate, and very carefully, and very slowly, just put your thumb on the end of the plate, and just slide it in a touch. That's too far the other way, so same rules again. Always keep your eye on what you're doing. Small adjustments are key. There we go, two little clicks. And how's that doing? Too far the other way, so that must be one click that way. Okay, that's nice and bonnet. Let's undo this one. So far, so good. Right, there we go. Pretty much it. Yeah. Nice. Right. Comes the moment of truth. So we'll turn the gimbal on. Power button at the side. One, two, three lights and a bing. And go to your DJI Ronin app. After you've logged in, balance test and begin test. This is a tricky bit to show to a camera because you need to tilt this onto an angle of about there. So begin test. What we're watching for is the lens or the camera assembly doing any kind of micro wobbling as it goes diagonally left and diagonally right. So far, so good. And it should tell you if it's okay or if things need adjusting. There we go. And stopped. There we go. First time. Tilt. Excellent. Roll. Excellent. Pan. Excellent. Okay. So then go back. One step, and then the next one, next to balance test, is motor parameters. Press that one, don't have to tilt the gimbal anymore, and then press auto tune. Please confirm to proceed, okay, and you'll see the little wobbles. There it goes, it's just measuring how much power it needs to give it each of the three axes to maintain that nice smooth balance. Okay, it's just going through, it updates with a percentage, I don't know if you can see that. And there we go, and then you've got a score, tell me what's what. So, three clicks, selfie mode, hello, two clicks, back to the front, and joystick left, joystick right, and I've reversed the roll, uh, pitch axis, so I push forward like computer games, and it goes down, pull back, and we climb up, okay, and then 
two clicks again, centralizes. That's about it. Create, pretty clever. Virtual joystick, there we go. For some reason, this doesn't reverse, so on this, I have to press up to go up and down to go down. Press the recenter. This is quite clever, it'll tilt sideways. And it'll tilt sideways. But all kinds of creative options there. You can smooth it, speed it up. Active track, we need to do with a phone. Um, I'll tell you what, join me in a second and we'll. No, we won't. Um, let's see, create mode. So you've got virtual joystick, active track pro, which you need your phone on the hot shoe. Force mobile is a bit freaky, but we'll try that. Not got the cable in. <laughs> it's pretty clever. So, there we go. Balance gimbal. Just for reference, I've got my base plate is on which is about one and a quarter. 1.6 on the one under the lens and the bottom one is about 1.8. Okay, but each camera will vary. Thanks for watching.